Information about a local lie team investigation into the Shelby County government computer shut system. Remember it was called Odyssey? Yes, it caused quite an odyssey actually. A glitches in the system over the past two years have meant the county lost out on more than $6 million in uncollected court fines and fees. Local 24 News reporter Mike Matthews reports the majority of that money will never be recovered. Well guys, as you probably know, in Shelby County they call their big computer system Odyssey. Actually, it's been called a lot of other things over the last few years, none of them which I can say right now on television. Nevertheless, one thing it's cost is money. Lots of it. It started right around the presidential election day in 2016, so it went under the radar for a while. The new computer system called Odyssey had just gone online in Shelby County. And right away, there were problems. So many that Shelby County Commissioners recently asked for an audit of the courts. So we did a review of what our revenues for court fines and fees were prior under the old system and what were they during the time we were installing Odyssey and having problems. Those problems included holding people in jail even after they'd been legally released because the computer paperwork never showed up. For those who went to court, there was another surprise. We believe the revenues during those two-year time period were down by at least six million dollars. Current criminal court clerk Heidi Kuhn was elected after the computer problems. The court system runs on what is called certified costs, she says. When we have a case, we bill the state, and the state reimburses us for fines and fees. Once we receive that money, then we can allocate it to the other entities. The state is going to help a little. We have further gone back and identified where we can rebuild and collect some of those uh, billing problems and about a million for that, primarily in criminal court, we can collect from the state and we are in the process of doing that. The five million dollars or so that's left, it's gone. Heidi Kuhn says she's been able to work through the computer problems and says the system seems to be working pretty good right now. In Memphis, Mike Matthews, Local 24 News.